What's up, Dub Nation? Your Golden State Warriors are always looking to refine and enhance the roster to bring home those championships, and today we've got some intriguing news on that front. The offseason might not have delivered the star power many were hoping for, but the dubs are far from done with their search for the perfect pieces. In fact, there's a new potential addition to the squad that could shake things up. Before we dive into the details, do me a favor and smash that like button if you're excited about the upcoming season. It really helps us out, and you won't want to miss any updates on what could be a pivotal year for the Warriors. Now, let's get into it. According to a report from the Israeli outlet Sports Channel, with a nod to Euro Hoops, the Warriors have been quietly working out Brazilian forward Bruno Caboclo. For those of you who might not remember, Caboclo was a first-round pick back in 2014 by the Toronto Raptors. He last played in the NBA with the Houston Rockets during the 2020-21 season, but he's been making waves internationally ever since. Caboclo just wrapped up an impressive run at the 2024 Paris Olympics, where he averaged 17.3 points per game, leading the Brazilian national team and ranking 12th in the entire tournament. Standing at 6 foot 9, he also pulled down 7.0 rebounds per game, showing he can hold his own on both ends of the court. His performance against Team USA in the quarterfinals turned heads, as he dropped 30 points and grabbed six boards, even though Brazil came up short in the end. So why is Caboclo working out with the Warriors? According to his agent, Daniel Hazan, Bruno is training with the team until Thursday with the hope of securing a contract. Hazan seems confident, saying Caboclo believes he will succeed in landing a spot on the roster. For the Warriors, this could be a low-risk, high-reward move. With a need for depth and versatility in the forward position, Caboclo could provide the kind of spark that the dubs are looking for. He's got the size, the athleticism, and now, after his Olympic showing, the experience to contribute right away. Plus, at just 28 years old, there's still room for growth in his game. But let's keep it real, Dub Nation. The Warriors are in a unique position right now. After missing out on big names like Paul George and Laurie Markkinen this offseason, every addition counts. Caboclo isn't the star some fans were hoping for, but he could be the kind of under-the-radar pickup that fits perfectly with the Warriors' system. Remember how key role players have been to our past championships? Think of guys like Andre Iguodala or Sean Livingston, players who might not have been stars elsewhere but thrived in the Warriors' environment. The big question now is whether Caboclo can show enough during these workouts to convince Steve Kerr and the front office that he deserves a shot. If he can bring that Olympic intensity and translate it into the NBA, we might be looking at the next great Warriors reclamation project. But what do you think, gold-blooded? Is Bruno Caboclo the right fit for this Warriors squad? Could he be the key piece that helps push us back into contention? Or should the Warriors keep looking elsewhere? Drop your thoughts in the comments below, and let's get the conversation started. And hey, if you enjoyed this update, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for all the latest Warriors news. We've got a lot more coming as the season approaches, and you won't want to miss a single moment. Until next time, stay gold, Dub Nation.